Hey girls and guys, it is Anna from Style Let's Play. We are back with The Sims 4, my life. And today we are starting off with my daughter, Olivia, because as you guys know, she recently aged up and she is gonna also be starting her first day of school soon, which is always a very, very big deal. So I wanted to give her a little makeover and I wanted to start off with her everyday look because that's the most important one because that's what they're gonna be in every single day. So her personality is very angelic. So we want to make sure that, you know, her clothing style fits that as well. I've never seen that skirt before Ooh, that's actually really cute oh I like that skirt and that one with the little stars on the side paired up with like a really cute colorful top that would be really nice definitely I prefer it to this one because I feel like that one's a little bit plain I don't really like the ruffles on that one. I'm not a fan of the ruffles. This one is cute too with the, oh my gosh, I love the little bow. <gasps> Ooh, this one might be good too. And if we go with like a denim one, I mean, any shirt could kind of go with it. So let's stick with that one for now. And now let's look for a nice cute top to go along with the skirt. So let's see. Oh, okay. Um. I'm thinking just like a plain t-shirt maybe or like this one here is cute because it's got like the little sleeves, the little puffy sleeves here. Um, is there any other top? See, I would do that, but with fall, like fall is here and it's a little bit cold for that. So we're not, not going to do that for sure. And some leggings would be cute with this too maybe. All right, let's try this top here. Ooh, I like that. With the yellow. Oh my gosh. That's such a cute outfit. I love this. I feel like it's so cute. And then it's kind of like a little cover up. So if it gets cold, you know, I'm in love with that. I'm in love. I like it. And then for the shoes, I'm thinking some flats or some sandals maybe. Because, But I would prefer flats because flats go with everything kind of. Even these here, and they're, they're be, they would be a bit more comfortable, I think. So, let's see. Mm, yeah, I think I'm going to go with those. Or maybe just some white flats. That could work, too. What about... Mm, no, I don't really like that. I wish there were some other shoes. What about these here? <gasps> those are cute! Some little white trainers. I like that. That's good. And now, for her hair... Let's see if we could come up with anything. So we got, we could go with some braids. Um, let's see. We could have her hair down as well. I do like the bow. I also like the little braids too. I think they're cute. Especially with the little clips. Okay. So adorable. But I'm always a fan of a braid. <gasps> oh, look at that. Wow. <gasps> that is so pretty. Oh my gosh. We're going to go with this one. Okay, that is so cute. Oh my gosh, I love her outfit. <gasps> okay, I'm happy with this. I am so happy with this. And I feel like with her, I could just kind of feel like she would wear glasses. I don't know why, but I just get, I just get that vibe. I get that vibe that she would have glasses. So we're definitely going to give her some glasses. I think it would be cute. Let's see which ones go best. <gasps> oh, those are cute. Or we could give her like some more traditional ones. Okay, those are too boxy, I think. I think I prefer these. And it kind of looks like her dad's glasses too, because Ricky has glasses. Okay, we're definitely going to go with those. And now she needs a nice party outfit. Well, formal outfit. So for this, let's go into the dress section and see if there's anything on there that, you know, goes well already. Um, I think this dress is cute here. I don't necessarily like the color of it. But maybe there's another color that will work. Mm, that one's not too bad. The solid like red with the white. I don't mind that one too much. This is super cute. This one is also really cute. But I feel like it's a little too formal. <gasps> what about this? Oh, I'm in love. In this blue, we should definitely have like a blue theme for her. I'm going with that dress for sure. And now we need some shoes to go along with it. So we're going to go with some white shoes, but these are going to be like the dressy kind. And then for her hair, I think a 
full updo would be good. So is there like a bun or anything like that that we could go with? Okay, that's just a ponytail. I would prefer like some... Yeah, like that. Okay. Mm, I think we're gonna go... We could go with the little bow, but it just doesn't match the dress. And that would kind of bother me, to be honest. Mm -hmm. It would bother me. And maybe we could just look for some accessories to go along with it. So obviously we're not going to put ha a hat because that'd be a little bit much. They definitely should add like flower crowns or something. I don't know. Let's go with a necklace. Oh, we should definitely go with a necklace. Yes, we're going to definitely go with a necklace. Yes, perfect. And then we're going to give her her glasses as well because she needs her glasses to be able to see. So which one were the ones that we went with? Which Was it this? Yeah, there we go. Okay, perfect. And now athletic time. Let's see what we could come up with this. Um, I think just some regular like sweatpants or something these are cute those aren't bad i like these okay and then maybe just like a plain t-shirt or something i mean it's just running around anyway it's not anything crazy so let's go with yes okay good and then for this one we'll have her hair braided to the side or two little ponytails. Yes! All right, and now PJ time. Who doesn't love some nice PJs? Let's see if they have any cute onesies or anything like that. Oh, they do have a onesie. We have to go with the onesie. We have to. It's just, you cannot not go with the onesie. So we're gonna go with like these little cat aliens. Oh no, this is cute too. And that looks super snuggly. Yes. I love this. And then, of course, some cute little funny slippers. <laughs> and now for her party outfit. So with this one, there is like some, there is a few dresses. Like this one is very cute. It's very summery though. That's the only thing. And it's not really summer anymore. It's winter now. So I'm wondering if we should kind of change it up a little bit. So I'm going to try that. Let's go look for some nice sweaters, maybe. I'm not really a big fan of any of these sweaters, though. That's the only problem I have. I'm not a big fan. <laughs> Definitely not a fan of these. And let's see. Um, Let's go with some dresses. We could pair something else together. Like, even that one's really cute. But no, I think for the party, we're going to go with some jeans. Because usually when kids are at parties, they're like running around, having fun. So we're going to go with jeans this time. And we need a cute top. Maybe we could go with this one here. I think this one would be nice. I just, I'm not a fan of the color selection. I do like this one though. I do like it. Mm-hmm. I do. I think it's cute. We could go with this top here. This is like a party top. Definitely. Okay, we're gonna go with that. And then let's change the jeans really quick. I would like some skinny jeans. I think skinny jeans would look nice with this. Or maybe some different color jeans. So maybe some light jeans. Or some really, really dark jeans. Either one, I think. <gasps> Ooh, okay. Those, those jeans are a little too funky. They're a little too out there for my liking, you know? <laughs> oh, let's go with some white jeans and then for some shoes we could just go with these right here yeah i don't mind that or let's just go with some tennis shoes again yeah that's cute and now for her swimwear which is last but not least i'm gonna go with oh my gosh i love that top and then some shorts and what color should we go for that's not bad. Let's try to change the top and see if we have another one. The cute little butterfly one's nice. And now she needs a summer outfit. So we got this cute dress and now all we need is some cute little flip flops and we are ready to go. So let's see. I'm not a big fan of those in particular. So let's try these here. Let's see how these look. 
See, if I had a blue flower one, it would have been perfect. Because it would have gone so well. But we don't have we don't have them. So the little blue stones don't really go for me. They don't they don't really go that well. So we're gonna go with some white flip-flops. There we go. And now for the cold, cold winter. We could definitely do some boots. But I feel like if we do boots, I want to do these instead. Or maybe like some Ugg boots. Oh, yes. Our daughter is going to be very fashionable. Yes, girl. <laughs> you rock those Ugg boots. <laughs> and now we just need a nice, warm, cozy sweater. And that is it. We're done. So we could definitely go with this one. <gasps> Oh my gosh! That, I love, this is one of my favorite outfits. So now all we need is a nice little cozy hat. So let's see if we could find one. I prefer one where you could still see her hair. Oh my gosh! It's, it is too cute. It is way too cute. It is melting my little heart. Like, do we have gloves? Do we have gloves? No, we don't. I wish we did because then it would have been so good. So here are her outfits. There they are. Yes! I have to say, this is by far my favorite makeover that we've done so far. I feel like everything just went together so, so well. Ah! Let me know what you think of her cute little makeover. The next thing we need to do is make over her room as well. Oh, children are so much work, aren't they? You just gotta buy them clothes, redo their rooms, help them with their homework. <laughs> All right, so let's get her in her everyday outfit. So here we go, and let's see what it looks like. I, I love it. I think it is so adorable. Look! Melts my heart. So it is Sunday, which means her first day of school is going to be on Monday, I think. Yep, she's going to start school on Monday. Her room is not officially made over just yet, but she does have her bed and she does have like, you know, a little reading area. But at least we got her like back to school shopping all done. So we got to make sure that she's fully rested and ready to go. Has Oliver done his homework? Has he? Oliver, have you done all your homework? I don't think so, buddy. So you've got to go. Oh, you have. Okay. He's such a good kid, isn't he? He just does his homework, does as he's told. Let's go ahead and give you a little nap. Oh, Ainsley, you pooped your pants. Oh my gosh. Little girl, you're just out here. Just, it, it's just, it's just nasty a little bit. All right. Like you've got to learn to potty train yourself. Actually, I'm the parent. I should be, um, potty training her. <laughs> Technically, I'm failing her as a parent, aren't I? I'm the one that's letting her down. So go Walking on. Up, can you give him? Can you give her a bath, please? Thank you, cause she smells real stinky right now. It is not a cute look right now. Mm -mm. So <laughs> I'm taking a nap because let's be honest, that's what I always do. So and I am feeling a little bit tired, but I want to start making the family eat a little bit healthier. That's what I want to do. I really want to start trying to be healthier work out more and start setting like a routine, a schedule for me and the family. Where we have breakfast, we go to school, we do our homework, all that good stuff. Cause right now, let's be honest, we're a little all over the place. So right now I'm gonna have her do a nice little workout while Ricky's taking care of Ainsley and the other two kids are taking a little nap. So once they get up, hopefully, well, I think dinner is gonna be ready already because there should be some already in the refrigerator. Yes, there is. There's some pan fried tilapia, which is gonna be so good for everyone. See, dinner's already ready. Uh, Olivia could go get some food. Oh my gosh, still, I love her outfit. Ah, it's so cute. I did such a good job. Let me know if you wanna hire me to style you. <laughs> just kidding, no. It's not a good idea. That was just luck. And to be honest, it probably, her outfit probably looks terrible and I just don't even know it because um, I don't know what good fashion sense is, you know? So here she is working out. To be honest, we should try to get the kids to work out too because we gotta teach our kids to be healthy as well. She is real struggling there. Girl, are you okay? I just, did she fart? I think she farted. Ooh, oh, you smell bad. Okay, you know what? 
I wanted you to cuddle with your, your hubby today, but you got to take a bath first because, girl, you smell real bad right now. So Oliver is now wide awake. He's just having some fun outside. You know what? Olivia should go outside and play too, but it is quite late, and I want them to get to bed soon, even though they just had their nap, because oh, they've got school tomorrow, and it's going to be a long, stressful day. So let's go ahead and have them take a piece of cake. What is Olivia doing? Oh, she was going to go outside and play. Go ahead and play by yourself then. How long until Aisley ages up? So Aisley, that's uh, the daughter that we adopted, has five days until she ages up. I have... Nine days until I'm an old lady. Oliver has six days until he's a teenager. Or what? Oh, gosh. I'm not sure if I'm ready for the teenage life. I'm really scared. Teenage Children, boy. toddlers are difficult enough, but teenagers, they're on a whole other level. They got emotions to deal with. And oh, I'm not ready for that kind of life. And I'm going to be old by the time my kids are teenagers. I'm not sure I'm going to have the energy to run around after them, but we're going to have to wait and see how it goes. So you guys, in the comments down below, let me know, after seeing Olivia's makeover, let me know how we should style her room. What theme should we go with? Leave me some suggestions down in the comments below. I hope you guys had fun watching. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and share. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!